Nepal's parliament has approved long-delayed amendments to the Transitional Justice Act. The bill is aimed at addressing war crimes committed during country's Maoist insurgency, which the victims say some problematic provisions remains. The most recent amendment, which was approved earlier this month by a cross-party task force, aims to assist Nepal in mending old scars. However, victims and activists point out that although there has been progress in the long-stalled process, some problematic provisions such as the classification and definition of human rights violations persists. Critics say the amendments risk shielding those responsible for some serious crimes, including war crimes and crimes against humanity, and denying some victims access to reparations. Security forces and former rebels have been accused of torturing, killing, raping and forcefully executing disappearances of people during nation's decade-long decade civil war, which ended in 2006 and resulted in the killings of more than 16,000 people and thousands more have been reported missing. And for more on this, our correspondent Saloni Murarka has sent us this report from Kathmandu. Nepali lawmakers today met in the parliament with a single agenda to pass the Transitional Justice Bill. And the bill was successfully passed with a majority after a consensus was reached between major political parties. This bill was crafted by three political parties to ensure and resolve all the issues related to enforced disappearances and truth and reconciliation process following the Nepal's decade-long conflict. The key agreements that the political parties have reached on this bill includes defining arbitrary or intentional killings as murder, second, extending support to ex-combatants, third, assuring uh, relief and compensation for the families of security personnel affected in the conflict. Nepal Prime Minister K.P. Sharma Oli, in his address to the parliament, highlighted on the significance of this bill in Nepal's peace process, calling it a global model. Critics earlier had uh, raised their issues and argued that the bill draft formed previously failed to enforce prosecution on serious crimes and also that it overlooked the concerns raised by the victims' groups, lawmakers, human rights activists. The Nepal's Transitional Justice Commissions, formed in 2015, have failed to even complete a single investigation, despite receiving over 60,000 complaints. Saloni Murarka for Vion, World is One in Kathmandu, Nepal. For all the latest news, download the Vion app and subscribe to our YouTube channel.